What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another Canadian Cannabis Review with Dave and Gavin. What's Morning, up, Dave? Buddy. How you doing? Not too bad, you? Good. What do we got on tech? Today we've got Lemon Dory. It's another uh, Scotia product, or Breathing Green, either or. That's why I'm wearing the shirt. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it's uh, very popular. It's been hard to get to get our hands on, just uh, or it seems to sell out very quickly. It's a Sativa Hybrid, and it's rated at, well, this specific batch looks like it's rated at just over 15%. Nice. But, yeah, it's very popular. Uh, it's called Lemon Dory, uh, just, uh, you know, because of the lemony taste. And uh, where it was developed by... Uh, and you can smell the citrus right on yeah, it. Yeah, where it was developed by a local producer, they, uh, they're referencing the, the actual yellow dories that we have around the province, which is... Like the boats? Yeah. <laughs> All right. And then they're using nice packaging, nice little envelope. Yep, yeah, Open packaging. it easily, boom. Right on. A little grippy. Very, uh, Stickers on there. I've, all the information you got on a carton this big, yeah, right yeah, here. Exactly, and it's got those handy thumb. I don't know if you can see those, but the thumb prints right here. Where They're kind of grippy to slide it open. With. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so that's always nice. <laughs> I realize that I don't wash my hands enough with that sometimes, or I've been poking up like dirty bowls with those packages <laughs> because I'm like, oh, my oh, fingers are dirty. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of grip that's why there's some slippage i guess yeah. <laughs> uh, and this has been open for a few days now has it or? yeah it's still i mean the moisture content is still better than the, a lot of the other nslc products nice yeah so hopefully it should smoke very well like it's got a lot of positive feedback from what i've been told and and it's a nice morning sativa so it should treat us well and yeah for sure Curious how this will compare to the nor'easter as well, which we love so much. Oh yeah, yeah. The nor'easter was one of the best sativas yeah. I've tried so far. No, that's not. And in your notes, does has it won any awards or anything like no, that? No, no. It's uh, like it's strictly been developed in Nova Scotia, and it's just recent all by right. by them by Scotia. Is this all notes on Lemon Dory you have? Or oh no, these are these are my other notes. Oh, okay, that's making like I thought yeah. you had a whole pile of notes there that we just hadn't gotten into. No, 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 it's just, uh, yeah, no, I just wrote down. Uh, right now, this is only available in three and a half, so I believe I paid about $45 for it, from, as I recall. It's interesting. Or maybe they're, like, creeping their prices up, because that's what the market will bear. Maybe, but... Because the Nor'easter was 35 and I was so impressed by that price. Yeah. Yeah. So. And then... And it's been a... I don't remember when I bought this either, so... You been getting outside or anything? The sun's... Oh my God, it's jumping out. It's beautiful out there right now. It's nice. uh, you know it's still cool, but it's starting to warm up, and it's going to go up to almost ten degrees. Is that what you're calling nine degrees? Yeah, <laughs> no, that's what I'm calling seven degrees. But you know, I'm still rounding up. Cause, All right. Yeah, you know. But spring's coming. It is sunny. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You can tell spring's on the way. Thank, I thank God, April's next week. Already, next, yeah. Burger yeah. week next week too. Oh yeah, that's right. If you're in Halifax, anyways, we do like get a bunch of restaurants participate um, in all sorts of different <coughs> tasty burgers. Or some might be less tasty, but you know, there's a bunch of burgers, so some have to be less tasty. It's true. <laughs> you're not going to get a tasty burger every time. It's not like Big Kahuna Burger. <laughs> nope. There, Although, has a Big Kahuna burger. there is a Big Kahuna Burger. With pineapple and shit? Uh, I don't remember. I know there was a pineapple burger. I didn't actually read the Big Kahuna Burger. Do you think they have a tasty beverage? I would hope so. <laughs> At least Sprite. <laughs> All I've done is hang out in the kitchen. I guess I watched UFC last night. Oh, yeah. And then, like, pecked away at cooking stuff. Like, made a roast and stock. And oh, God. That's a bunch productive of for a Saturday night. And... <laughs> Jesus. Well, a lot of it's me sitting there. Like, yeah. Was I true. was watching TV with you while the oven did its part. Well, yeah, that's true. And I cut the bones <laughs> off the roast and put them in a pot with, like, leftover veggies and continued sitting on the couch. <laughs> So it feels productive. Like, yeah, I don't you're get getting anywhere. stuff down, but you're not. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's not like I'm outside, which I really should be. I'm I'm go down to Point Pleasant later or something. Get a walk in. Nice. Yeah, it should be a good day for a walk. Are the sidewalks and shit super wet? Everything's pretty pretty clear. All like, right. Yeah. So I might be getting hiding onto trails and aren't complete shit shows. Yeah, yeah. You should be all right there. Like most of the snow's been melted away. Although I imagine in the park there's going to be, uh, but. A bit more, just where they've got so much tree cover in there. Yeah. That 
prevents a lot of meltage. They've got like grown trails with like drainage yeah. and stuff. Oh well, yeah, for yeah. sure. I'm excited to start exploring again now. Like I don't know about you, but I don't winter well. Uh, no, me neither. That's <laughs> enough to make me want to move back to the West Coast. Always. <laughs> back to BC? Oh man, that's the only place I'd go if I ever moved anywhere, I think. Alright. If I go anywhere, I always said I'd go somewhere where the weather's nicer and you know, for for anybody who knows, Vancouver weather is much, much nicer than uh, than it is here. <clears throat> On a consistent basis, you know, it's always sweater weather. There's been one day where they got below, well, I, I think there was one day a couple of years ago where they got down to like minus 23. But still, you know, in Vancouver, it's not consistent and it doesn't last for any longer than a day. What if we just like pulled a Russia and the Crimea and we took some part of the Caribbean? Like, could we just annex Haiti? I don't see why not. It's not like they're a rich country. So we'll build them up, <laughs> and we'll make it basically Canada's senior paradise. Yes. All right. That's fair. Actually, there's... actually, we probably have a bunch of old ladies to go down there and volunteer as well. Like, there's the Sunshine Coast on the in, in BC as well. That's you know, it's not got tropical weather, but it's it's very nice weather, and it's much you know, it is much nicer than they do, than they do get in Vancouver. But yeah. There. All right, we got our lighter over here already, so we're uh, we're set. I was so proud of myself setting that. Oh, there. that was delightful. <laughs> My usual rolling job. Do you always spin the tips like that? Oh. Don't know why. Just force a habit. Okay. Yeah. This brings the brings the end to a nice little. See, I did. Do pinch them when I'm traveling a little, but I've always tried to leave them open a little bit so you sort of draw on them like a cigarette when you're lighting them. Yeah. Well, I don't. I don't draw on the first. So that's the difference. I light mine like a cigarette, or I just take a haul off the stupid thing. Okay. Mm. Yeah, that lemony flavor is really there. <laughs> I can taste that already. A nice smoke too. Yeah, for sure. Not uh, not a harsh smoke at all. It's uh, nice and smooth. It doesn't catch in your throat like some weeds do. Nice flavor. Yeah. So was the taste, and they just named it after the boat, or did yep. they say anything else? No, nope. lemon dories because of the lemony taste. It's uh, what are the uh, what are they called? Uh, pinene and uh, karyophyllene. Are those so the terpenes? Those the, yeah, those are the terpenes that are in it. I imagine there's probably some lemonine in there as well. Yeah, that's the... Uh, we need to get one of those charts that say what the terpenes do as well. Yeah, for sure. So. Um, yeah, and then we'll you ordered to... a vaporizer that people yeah. actually recommended the same vape a bunch. Yeah, of well, the airizer was, uh, was coming up quite a bit. So uh, I went with the Solo 2, and uh, you get a free Airizer Air with, uh, with that. So I I'm think getting... we have two comments like that, so thank you for yeah, suggesting absolutely. that absolutely. I appreciate the, uh, the help, and uh, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll let you know how the vaporizers go. Um, what surprised me is I've had a vaporizer for years, so I wasn't going to vocalize it because I just bought one, but the same Airizer company makes the one I have, and I've <laughs> always really enjoyed it. Um, right. And quality has been there because I use it like daily for years now. Like you said, you had about three or four years. Yeah, and it still works. And fine. it's just that tiny little remote's broken, but yeah. it's a very flimsy remote that I've used daily for years. Exactly. And the other thing is, you can buy a replacement remote, which I, I actually ordered for you off their website for what thirteen bucks? I think it was twelve ninety five. Yeah. So not expensive at all. Uh, the uh, the solo two I purchased was I believe two sixty or two seventy. And then uh, the uh, the free vaporizer I got was a, a value of two ten. So, you know, so are they plug in ones or battery ones? What did you end up? They're uh, they they're rechargeable. So okay. uh, the, the solo two I got was I think minimum three hour charge. So there you go. I mean, nice. yeah. And then what's the other one? Like the also the air, just the basic air air riser. I didn't look a lot into that one, but it seems you know it seems fairly half decent. All right, and yeah. they're both like drier type vapes. Yeah, cool. Yeah, I think you should enjoy them, especially at that price point. And like my experience with the Airizer company, which I didn't realize was like a big company till 
you know, this week yeah. has been phenomenal. Like, an old Excellent. roommate of mine had one of those cues, and I just like, well, I was like that one, so I ordered it, and yeah. it just kept working. Nice. And I have to say, the customer service is very good as well, because I made a mistake on my first order, and I emailed them right away, and they got back to me in less than 12 hours, and, you know, my order was fixed. It was fine, so yeah. I've, got, I've got no issues with this company. They're, uh, you know, my brief dealings have been very good. <laughs> <laughs> and then, if... I don't know if yours will ever need replacement parts, but there are still, like, the radicals across the, I guess it would be the basin is what we'd call it, the harbor. Yeah. Um, they would have parts as well. And some nice. Of them, yeah. Sure, you could probably get stuff like that at Mary Jane's and whatnot as well. No? Or they just carry the... They all, they carry Volcano. Oh, stuff. they're... Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, all right. Um, so same they're... with the Scotia store across from Clyde Street. Just they're Volcano? Carrying... Yeah. All right, so they're brand specific. Or they just don't care the air riser yeah. stuff, but maybe. Yeah. Huh. So I was craving a joint since I got up this morning. Just really wanted to smoke a joint while sitting around here this Sunday, and this one is satisfying the craving. Um, oh smoking God. nicely, slow. Nice head high, I'd say, pretty much right away. Yeah, for sure. It's nice. It's a good heady high. It's a good even high, like it's not overwhelming. Less stony than the nor'easter, I guess, but still yeah. like pleasant. Yeah, for sure. It's a good Sunday morning high. <laughs> Actually, yeah, it's a nice like start your day joint. I'm feeling Absolutely. some sativa energy and stuff. Yeah. Like, um, also by these folks, I got just that we haven't reviewed yet. What was it called? Mm -hmm. Meridian or something? Mirage. 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 Yeah. Um, and that's a super strong indica that basically made me have an immediate nap after lunch yesterday. So, well, I guess we might as well do that one next week. We've got it in. It's true. If it, if it lasts, now, we'll make sure <laughs> some of it lasts. Well, yeah. I mean, if not, we'll uh, we'll hitch up midweek and we'll do we'll do a special on it <laughs> <laughs> if it's gonna run out. Yeah, <laughs> I'm sure I can not smoke it all in a week. <laughs> Yeah, um, I'm breathing green and Scotia are like Pepsi and Coke, like one owns the other or something like that, or their sister companies. I, I don't think, know what the deal is. I think they're one and the same. Like breathing green, and I believe is the uh, so it's like Pepsi and Coke are all just like yeah, one company. the umbrella company, and then not like Taco Bell and Pepsi, I guess, which are also sort of one company but divided a little different. Be more like Pepsi and. I don't know who Pepsi owns. A lot of people. KFC, like Coke, Coke Pizza and Snapple. Hut, Taco Bell. <laughs> yeah. Um, Pepsi owns a bunch of yummy stuff. Yeah, they do. Nothing good for you, but yummy. There's nothing wrong with a chalupa. <laughs> not the homemade style, anyway. Uh, but I'm sure that's not what they do. <laughs> Jesus, that's nice. Yeah. All right, so we will be back in 20 minutes to let you know how we're feeling. Yeah, absolutely. But so far, so good. All right. All right. We'll be right back. Well, 20 minutes. And welcome back with Dave and Gavin. Hey, hey. Um, how are you feeling? Good. Good. Hey, I like it. Yeah, me too. Nice, nice, even high. I enjoy it. Definitely, uh, it's it's not a it's not a blow your head off kind of buzz, but uh, you know it's 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 really nice. You do very well at the park, you're like oh, popping around sure. at the beach. Yeah, this is a good daytime weed for sure. Um, have energy, pleasant feeling. The cor corners on the world are a little bit rounded. I'd be happy to smoke this again. Oh, for sure, I would definitely pick this up again. Which um, is why it's so popular, I guess. We can never get our hands on it. <laughs> so giving you the score, like definitely an eight or a nine. Like, yeah, for super sure. Happy. I'd buy with... it again. You know, as long as you're not looking to be, like, locked into your couch, which isn't designed to do, this stuff's great. No, exactly. It's nice sativa hybrid. Recommended. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe and become a Pothead today. Anything else you want to add? No, thank you, guys. Great. Thank you.